we talk about tribe and culture a lot here. You see it on the wall, one tribe, one vibe, and, and we talk about culture, and, and our foundations coaches talk about culture. And I want to explain a little bit what tribe and culture mean. Just had this meeting with our all of our staff the other day, and I thought it was good to just share that with all of you. Um, I, I define a tribe as a group of people, large or small, who are connected to each other, to a leader, and to a purpose. And I don't use the word leader in a singular sense. I don't want to be everyone in here's leader. But I truly believe that everyone in this room is a leader. That a tribe is not made up of members, a tribe is made up of leaders. And I really feel that way about this tribe. And if you take a culture and people and a shared vision, then you have our tribe. This is our tribe. Look around. It's pretty phenomenal. Entry in the tribe only requires one thing. Show up. That's all you got to do. You just got to show up. And then once you're here, make relationships, make connections, be a part of this community. And then everything else works itself out after that. <laughs> Culture is hard to define, right? I could give you a Webster's definition of culture, but it's hard to define. I speak about it, I study it, I've even been brought in by organizations to talk about it, but I probably couldn't sum it up on one slide for us. So instead, I just wanna share with you some of the things that I feel make our culture at SBD Athens phenomenal uh, and, and a place that unlike any other place, and I mean transcending martial arts. Authenticity, honor, integrity, and sincerity above all else. Aliveness, leadership, right? Everyone in here is a leader. Everyone in here is a leader. Personal responsibility. All people are welcome. All people, all goals. No one gets turned away. Community service and service to others. You know how important community services and service to others is to us. Celebrating achievements, which is what we're gathered today to do. But I'll celebrate any achievement. You, you, you just gotta tell me what you did and I'll make sure everyone knows it. I'll shout it. We got a wedding next weekend, but I'll, I'll wait till after that to shout that one. Family. Family means a lot to me. We have families on the map right now. We have families in this room right now. And I'd like to grow that way. I'd like you guys to all marry each other, have kids, let the kids grow up. It's just easier that way. Have kids, adopt kids, have them grow up, and have me coach them too. Nothing would make me happier. Meritocracy. This belt ceremony today, the people who are getting belts today earn those belts. They earn those belts. Nothing is given. Train and roll honestly with each other. The big five rules, which are on the wall. Coaching and mentoring. As soon as you learn a little bit, you're a coach to someone else. As soon as you get a couple stripes, six, eight months, and you're rolling live, someone new thinks you have superpowers, and they're gonna ask you questions, and it's up to you to coach them. And the elders of the tribe, it's up to you to mentor the younger members of the tribe. Every younger member in this tribe is trying to accomplish something that one of us has probably already tried to accomplish, and possibly failed at but we have good advice. So mentor the newer people, mentor the less experienced, mentor the younger. And last but not least, when I say one tribe, one vibe, this is what it means, what you're gonna see today. So we ready to get on with our beltings? Is that a word? It is now. It is now, yeah. So here's how you get to the next level. 